Greetings from Southern Yankee Homestead. This is your first time. Welcome. If you're a returning viewer, welcome back. Uh, today is going to be a simple video. Uh, it's going to take me two days to do, but very simple regardless. What we're going to be doing is storing a zucchini. Uh, we haven't had very much luck with zucchinis this year, and we typically don't have very much luck with zucchinis. Occasionally we do, but I think the weather in this particular area is too hot or we're doing something wrong, but we're going to continue trying. So, let's go ahead and uh, get this started. Uh, this is the simplest way we found to store zucchinis long term so that we can use them through the winter. Uh, it's fairly simple. Follow along. You need a knife and a cutting board. What we're going to do, we're going to naturally just Take the bottom off. We're going to leave the top on for now. And I'm going to use the, uh, oh wow, yeah. I'm going to use the butt of my knife to basically measure. Uh, that's uh, about 3 eighths of an inch chunks. So go here. And we're just going to cut a bunch of 3 eighths of an inch chunks. At this point, I'm just going to stand these up in little piles and we're going to make these into more manageable pieces. So we're just going to take it, split it in half. Now, off in the background here, I think you can see it. Yeah, off in the background here, you'll see our food dehydrator. That's all we're going to do. We're going to throw these in here. Make sure that they're not touching each other. And then we're going to throw on the throw it on some heat. If you have a different style dehydrator, you can use that. If you uh, there are ways to do it with the oven. It's just we're not going to do that because it raises the temperature too much in the house. And these are going to shrink down significantly. We're going to put that there, plug this in, put the lid on, and we'll see you tomorrow. All right, it's been about two days. Uh, we didn't um, we didn't dry this for two days. We shut it off uh, about midday yesterday, so the zucchini had about 14 hours on it, maybe 16, in the dehydrator. And this is what all what a whole zucchini turns into. Now, for storage purposes, it's very simple. We're going to take this dried zucchini, drop it all into a jar, and then we're going to vacuum seal it. So let me get this in there, and then we'll continue. For vacuum sealing, we have our food saver, and I have this attachment from my old food saver I purchased. Can you even see the jar? Yep. So it's a very simple process. Take and plug in the uh, accessory port. Make sure your mason jar lid is centered. Put this on there. And now, we're all sealed up. When it comes time to uh, use this, we can literally just pop this lid off and we have uh, dried zucchini for adding to soups and stews. Very simple, easy to store. We'll just put it up with the rest of our vegetables. The last batch we did lasted, well, we used it about a week ago in a farmhouse soup that I made. So, hope you enjoyed this episode. Like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye!